Welcome to the Spartan News Update. Due to our current situation, we are delivering your news from inside our homes. Dairy farms in Michigan are struggling right now to sell product as businesses, restaurants, and schools are closing due to COVID-19. Many farms are having to dump their milk supply but are doing their best to donate as much product as they can. The president of the Michigan Milk Producers Association, Joe Diglio, said for people that don't have access to groceries, they want to help supply during this time of need. And now we go live to Brianna for a nice story about a bar who's helping out their employees during this time. The sandbar in Tybee Island, Georgia, no longer has thousands of dollars plastered on the walls. For the last 15 years, customers have had the unique opportunity to write a message on a dollar bill and staple it to the wall. Like all other restaurants, the bar is closed for sit-down dining while people across the globe continue to fight through the COVID-19 pandemic. The bar's owner, Jennifer Knox, decided that while the bar sat empty, it was time to take down the dollars and help those who lost their jobs in the crisis. She was able to distribute over $4,000 to our now unemployed staff members. And now to Katie Schroeder with a story from the UK. Thanks, Bree. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge video chatted children at an elementary school in the UK. Schools in the UK are shut down, but some reopened their doors to provide care for essential workers' children. The children showed off hand-drawn pictures of their parents during the video call. They also shared with the Duke and Duchess what their parents are doing on the front lines during the pandemic. The royal couple gave the children praise and asked them to pass on messages of support to their families. Thanks for watching the Spartan Newsroom. I'm Katie Schroeder. Make sure to tune into the Spartan Newsroom website for all your top stories.